video i will be doing a shein haul so i ordered about 16 items <laughs> on shein and i am very excited to try them on so i'm gonna just get into the details of my order before i try them on the total that I spent on my order was 1,535 Rand. That is after the discounts that are applied on the app. That is the points and also the coupon code that I was given on the app. So I spent a total of 1,535 Rand. I received free shipping because my order was above 1,000 plus Rand. And for customs or taxes, I paid 132 Rand 67 cents, which I was surprised it was so less because when the bag came, <laughs> it was a bit heavy, but I didn't pay that much for customs. I paid about 132 Rand 67 cents. This is a remote control. So I took this because normally when I take pictures with my camera or with my phone, uh, with my camera I use my phone as my remote and sometimes it gets a bit bulky and it disturbs the shot. And when I use my phone, I use a timer and that normally disturbs like the light lighting of the camera setting and I can only use like my front camera if I want a proper shot. So I decided to get myself this remote. I will put the prices together with the pictures on the screen because I don't remember the individual prices of everything. Next up, I ordered strapless bras. So, because I kind of like have started wearing a lot of tops like these that don't look nice when you have a bra on underneath, I ordered two of these strapless bras so these are padded on the inside they have like a thick padding on the inside and they also came with strings i don't think they'll come with the straps of the bra so i got the black one and i also got the nude one i'm currently wearing the nude and this is how it sits on this is how it sits on basically and this is how it looks like over here i don't like this shape over here so it comes with three steps and i tried putting it on the first one because normally when you get a bra you start by tying it here and then move up but at the moment i have it tied up here because that is where i feel the most comfortable when it's here the bra feels a bit too gappy and too loose over here and it's not comfortable for me and i just don't like how it's sitting here it cuts <laughs> my booby into half and i really don't like that this is a size extra small so it doesn't come in like a 32 what what 34 what what it just comes in an extra small and the sizing on the sizing chart just kind of guides you on which um size to take so mine was an extra small and they're both extra smalls and yeah i just it feels comfortable at the moment because i have it on the last setting the question is how long will it last since i can't actually move it up i'm on like the last <laughs> um step so i'm hoping it will last longer because it is comfortable um i don't have to move it up that much but it's just like I feel like the padding over here, that's what I don't like. Next up, I got a head scarf. So this is in like a t-shirt material. With my last video, I didn't specify the material of the clothing. And on this video, I'm not going to make the mistake. <laughs> so the material of this is 80% cotton and 20% cotton, cotton blends. I'm not sure what that is. But it's like a... Um, t-shirt material i'm not sure if you can see like i've been wanting this type of a hair scarf because i feel like when people wear it it looks so nice i will show you in like a separate video where i have fully tied the scarf on but i feel like this type of head scarf is nice and easy to manage and the colors always look so nice so i can't wait to take off these braids and then wear it with like my natural hair and see how it looks it feels nice and stretchy and the quality because this is my first scarf of this kind i'm not sure how the quality is supposed to be like for me it's like it's thin it's it's really thin <laughs> but most scarves that i own are thin so 
I'm not sure, time will tell, time will tell. Next up, I also got this skirt. So I like how this looked on the model and people who fit it on. I am scared to buy bottoms on Shein because I have a really thick thighs and I need to be in the shop and fit the items so that I can see if it fits my shape really well. I would rather order a skirt than pants, like take the risk with a skirt. So this, I liked the pattern of the skirt and also the length. The material is 100% polyester material. Here it is. It is not see-through, which I like. And this is like the pattern of the skirt. It comes with a zipper on the side, which I feel like was a great add since the skirt is not stretchy at all. So getting this skirt on over my thighs is an issue. I have to like kind of wear it on top. And as you can see, on my thighs, it's too small for me. Like I can't actually tie the zip up. I'll have to like kind of push it up so that the zip close and it does not close all the way. So it becomes a high-waisted skirt for me, which is very uncomfortable. It's on the small side. Ooh, I just need to quickly check what size did I order? Wow, it's not unzipping. So the length of the skirt, I really, really like. I feel like it's nice and flowy from here to here. It's nice and flowy, but because of my body shape <laughs> over here, it's uncomfortable. I feel like the skirt was supposed to sit here, but it's too small for me to be sitting there. So yeah, this is the brown skirt. Next up, we have another skirt in a size extra small and it's also, it is see-through, but it's not that bad, but you can see it is see-through and the material is like a chiffon material. And this is what this skirt looks like. I love like the feel of this skirt. The only thing, it's really stretchy by the way, so... The extra small is actually a good size for me because it's really stretchy. And this is what the skirt looks like. And this is the length of the skirt on me. The material feels really, really good. I, I like the material of the skirt. My first top is this one over here. I actually wanted a set of these. I thought this would look like this because this I also got on Shein and this, I love this material. But this one, <coughs> sorry. This one is a size extra small. I feel like well, the first time I fit this shirt, it was too small, like it wouldn't fit over my head. So I wish I had gotten like a small, um, I feel like an extra small is too small because the material, in as much as it is stretchy, it doesn't have as much stretch as this one. So it doesn't, it's not as diverse. So it's a ripped material, black. I'm not sure if you can see. The material is 95% polyester and 5% spandex. Getting this over my head <laughs> is a mission. Oh. It's not bad. It's not bad. I don't know what I was doing, but I still feel like it's too small because it rolls up. It rolls up over here. It doesn't stay down and it just rolls up. Like I'm more, I'm more. I really wish I had gotten a small. I feel like the reviews kind of misled me this time around. Because they said um you can size down. They say you can size down since it's a stretchy material. If I do it like this, then it's fine. But you can see, Wooty, like in the back, the rolls. You can see the rolls in the back, which is like not nice at all. I feel like it's too small. So if you're going to get this top kind of size up, 
I wish I had gotten a small it would have been perfect because I like how it sits over here this is just the only part I enjoy about the top other than that mm -mm, I'm not a fan <laughs> of the sizing and the material like the material is fine the quality is good it's just the sizing it's too small for me next up is this bodysuit which is also a size extra small and i wish i had gotten a small but the quality on this one is really good it's double layered and as you can see it's double can you see yeah double layered and it is 87% nylon and 13% spandex so this I like the pictures on the reviews that is why I also decided to go with this color because I don't have anything in this color and I feel like this color is so beautiful yo getting into this bodysuit was an exercise an exercise this definitely I should have sized up into a small because that's the thing like over here at the top it's fine but as soon as you like start going down then it's an issue because as i was putting this on it took off my bra <laughs> it took off my bra and i don't like wearing like tops without a bra so it's definitely a top where you don't need a bra if you're comfortable with your nipples showing uh i'm not i'm not <laughs> So I would most probably wear it with like a bra like this, but like, whew, it's so tight. The material is like a swimming costume material. It's nice and breathable. And yeah, I feel like it's nice. It feels nice and soft and smooth. I just wish it would have been perfect if it was like a size small. Cause now I feel like I squeezed myself into this like bodysuit and stuff and it just it doesn't feel awkward it just feels like taking it on and off is a mission it's a really big mission next we have this top i bought two of these i got it in this orange because i like how the orange looked on the reviews on people's pictures so i decided let me just get two i got a chocolate brown is it a chocolate brown it's just a brown <laughs> i've got this brown one as well and i took this orange because i don't know which one to choose i like how both of them looked so this is a size small this time around like the sizing in bigger off and then the material is 95% rayon and 5% spandex. This material is stretchy. Mm -hmm. It is stretchy, but it doesn't have that much stretch into it. And as you can see, this is like the, the material. See, the brown feels like it's more see-through than like the orange. When you stretch it, it's see-through, but when it's like this, it's fine. So I feel like I should have gotten at least a medium on these because I've got both extra, I mean I've got small on both. This is what the brown top looks like. I feel like you definitely need like a dark bra when you're going to wear this because you can see like the color of the bra that I put on underneath. This bra guys, I, I don't think I like this bra. <laughs> like it makes my boobs look awkward, like honestly. But anyway, this is like the brown t-shirt. This might tear like it's too delicate. So the quality is not that good. I'm not a fan of the quality. This is the orange top. I honestly love this color. Like, I don't know. There's something about this color that just brings like happiness. Like, it's a happy color. I changed the bra from like the, the nude one. This because it's closer to like a white color and it was showing like you could see the outline of the bra and I changed into a black one I'm not sure how I feel about it but at least you can't see the color of the bra it's just like 
see the top you can only see the outline but i feel like with this shirt if you wear like a proper bra then it won't be as much of an issue it's just that i'm not a fan of these bras i do not recommend these bras do not get them <laughs> do not my hair is a mess i forgot how much work these try on holes are so my next one, oh, I already put, the, put it on, sorry. <laughs> my next one is this brown t-shirt. I'm not sure if it's an oversized shirt, but it's in like a chocolate brown color and it has heaven sent graphics on it. So this is the color. I love this top, very comfortable, very simple. I wish I had gotten like two or three more because like it's so convenient, it looks nice and stylish. Uh, it's in a, it's an extra small, thank God it's written there, I thought I would have <laughs> had to take the top off. It's in an extra small, it's 65% cotton and 35% polyester. So this is like a nice top. This is the length of the top. And yeah, simple love it it's this silk shirt i got it this is an oversized shirt so i got it in a size uh, where's the size this is a size extra small because the review said it really fits big it's a size extra small and it's 100 percent polyester for me for the price i feel like the shirt feels really good for the price like it feels really really good and this is what it looks like on the outside and then on the inside this is what it looks like so it's matte on the inside and then it's just a little bit like not shiny but it's smooth on on the outside so i tried to iron this shirt and in all honesty i need a steamer because the material is very delicate and it takes time to do with an iron because you need to be careful about the material but i love this shirt i love it the material is just beautiful the silk does not look like a cheap tacky is the silk or satin it does not look as cheap as you would think it, it's it's not giving off pajama it's just nice and like elegant material it's really oversized <laughs> so yeah i feel like this is a nice shirt to like dress up or dress down when you're feeling like it it's really nice and airy i just i love it here's the back by the way so it covers your butt so you can put on like i think leggings with it should be fine when like you don't feel like doing this But this is nice this is really really nice i think this i don't okay this brown shirt and this so far is my favorite because the clothing is practical the quality is good and i stress out it's not too oversized you can like work with it and then when you dress it up you look more this is the other shirt i've had this shirt in my cart for like almost a year because they need doubt i doubted the oversizedness of the shirt based on another shirt a shirt that i bought so i thought it would be too oversized and the price was a bit high at the time so since i had it in my cart for a long time they kind of reduced the price so that's why she in does that's what i noticed we'll see when you have an item in your cart or wish list for a long time they reduce the price so this is just this beautiful shirt i tried to iron it but i feel like with an iron it takes away the detailing like this nice flowy detailing and so it needs a steamer so that it maintains like the details of the shirt but this is how the shirt looks like it's also oversized i ordered a uh, extra small let me just quickly tie it up i really like the nice color um, I wish the collar wasn't as big as it is now but otherwise like the previous shirt is nice and I saw on one comment some lady con um, comment Uguti it's a bit itchy I can confirm Uguti on the on these parts here some of these parts it is itchy but if you have a vest underneath 
it's bearable let me say that it is itchy but it's bearable i just love the flow of this shirt and the color like the color guys and when it catches the light i love when it catches the light like i'm not sure if the camera is doing it justice but on the mirror imagine this with gold jewelry wow same as the other one but this one is a bit longer so you can just even dress it up even more nicely like this is a vibe this is like a whole entire vibe next up is this oh, is this a waistcoat not sure what kind of like jacket or jacket this is but the first one i bought looked good and i wish i had sized up on this one and i noticed when i fit these two the waist is really small but the shoulders are big so the sizing is also off when you size up you kind of lose out on the space above when you size down you kind of lose out on the snatchedness of the waist so i ordered this in a small so the comment said size up so my safest size is a small a medium gets too big sometimes because i'm an extra small at the top depending on the shop so i switch between extra small and small and the material on this is 100 percent polyester it, it's a shirt material it's really thin it's thin material you see really thin material and this would look nicer with like a white top but because we're trying it on you see like with the bra it's worse like I can't tie this on the waist I think a medium would have been perfect because even here it's tight like when I tie it up I can only tie up this button at the top and then that's it over here it just flaps up like this so this is really disappointing because this was one of my most exciting purchases but because the sizing is like it's not correct and I can't really move the buttons anyway so there's nothing I can do about it at least if there was like extra material where I can move the button forward it would have been easier because now I have to squeeze myself in like it's like they make these things so people with very small waists and china won't fit in that category like look at how beautiful this was gonna be like imagine with a white shirt or like a white <coughs> high neck or white long sleeve this this would have been so nice i'm disappointed with this but i'm still gonna wear it because i love it i'm just not gonna fully button it down we're almost done this is another one that i wanted to buy i liked the color of this one and the design as well this is a size small just like the other one i went on based on the reviews because the review said it's a bit big at the top but the waist is also the same as the last one it's pretty small on the waist the material is 100 percent polyester with this one what i noticed is that because of the design i have i can move the buttons so that it does tie up nicely like this is so beautiful like it's so beautiful it's just over here i can't so you can tie it up like this or like that but i can't tie it just with the other one i can this time it doesn't even reach across so tying it is like a whole whole mission this is the back at the back it's supposed to give like this thing over here but it's not because the waist is too small so this is what it looks like when i have like tied it up and you can't wear this alone you also need a bra or like a top underneath but this is also like awkward yana. but for me it's fine i don't mind it i don't mind it i feel like once 
once I move like the button a bit forward, then we should be, we should be fine. <laughs> Based on my first order I made on Shein, I loved the dresses that we got at the time. So I was like, let me order another dress. And this one looked so nice on the website. Like it looked so nice. I was like, let me just, you know, practice faith and buy it. So it's this floral, I don't know what color this is. It's not white. I think it's off-ish white. Um, it's full of flowers. Like it's full of flowers on the website. It's so nice. Like on the website, it's nice. Now the material, I feel like, Jay, listen. Like the material is noisy it comes with a belt that is not attached i've got this in a size extra small because people said it fits large the reviews are very important when you're buying these things from shein it has an elastic band inside i hate how noisy it is this is 92 percent polyester and 8% spandex. I feel like almost everything is polyester over here. <laughs> I don't like this dress. I don't like this dress. It feels like I'm wearing plastic. Like it's so noisy. Let me try and tie it up. <laughs> Just not a fan. Not bad. I feel like <laughs> just a... so it has this like V neck V neck shape. But if you don't like this, you can like it has a button or like a clip over here. There's a button that you can clip so that it closes up the V. But it's still too deep for me, you know the way I like the shape of the dress I think it's the flowers ne? it's the flowers because honestly if this was like plain white I would I would I would wear it if it was plain white but now I feel like mommy society you know those stock fell mothers like no hear it this is the back. If this was a skirt, it would have been fine. I think. I just don't like the dress, okay? I don't like the dress. And on honesty, this dress is not for me. I don't know how to feel. I feel like the shape is perfect. It's just the flowers. It looks so nice on the website. But on me, am I gonna wear it? Yes, I'm gonna wear it just to see how I feel in it when I'm outside <sighs> and it's not as like see-through it's not see-through like it's not see-through at all this is the last item honestly let me share my final thoughts with Shein I feel like oh, Shein is becoming more of a miss than a hit I get more disappointed which, with each order that comes the sizing for me, I feel like the clothes are fine. Like the first ones that I tried, they're fine. It's just the sizing that's off. But this one, I, I don't like it. Will I order the bras? It's just a no no. Will I order again? Probably not. This should be my last order because I feel like, also, in terms of the environment, I've been watching like a lot of videos on fast fashion and she in specifically. I don't like the many plastic bags that the clothes come in. I feel like there's just too many plastics. If they can maybe change the way they package their clothing, and actually, I share with some of the quality of the clothes I'm not happy with. I know you get what you pay for, but in all honesty, if you get if you can get this shirt or this shirt at like a good price and it's good quality and you get these shirts at like almost similar price points like it's a hit or miss with the quality as well so i don't think i'll order from Shein again because this time around i was a bit disappointed like just as i was disappointed <laughs> with my uh, with my last order so yeah 
these items I'm content with, I can make them work like this dress in as much as I would like it. I feel like I can make it work. I don't know, I'll just find a way. So, uh, it looks nice, it makes me look cute. I don't wanna look cute. I, I don't wanna look cute. I don't wanna be a, a cute 26 year old. But like, it's my money, so <laughs> I don't wanna return it. So I have to wear it. So that's it. That's me with my clothes. <laughs> so if you enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you again in another one. Bye.